What's going on guys, it's Joe here and welcome back to another Catch That Boss Pet episode. It's been a while. We've got two new bosses for you today then. I will be staying at Vindicta after that insane look. I mean I just have to. Will it continue? I don't know, let's find out. But first, to the intro. <laughs> So the first boss I actually went to this episode was Criara, and the reason for this is because someone told me about the perk Precise 5. I'm a noob, I know, but yeah, I'm determined to get that now, so why not? I've been led to believe it's 5 pieces of the Armadillo War Priest that I need. Yeah, 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 5 pieces. Yeah, anyway, I've got 2 pieces of that now, so we are well on our way to getting that. Obviously, I'm going to want it for all 3 of my weapons, so... I'm going to have to nerd this boss for quite some time. It's a shame it has to be the Armadillo War Priest, because I've already completed the Zamian Bandos sets. But, you've got to do what you've got to do. Anyway, let's see how we got on in our first few trips at Cree. Oh, she don't see the light that's shining Deeper than the eyes can find it Maybe we are made of blind So she tries to cover up her pain So I actually went one and a half hours dry, one and a half hours, you're probably asking. Yeah, if you remember my start in KC, it was just 31, it was my first solo trip and I messed up just a little bit, I forgot a few things, I have mastered it now though, I promise, and I took my dry streak to two and a half hours before I finally got my first drop. Luckily, it was one of the better ones, the Armadil chain skirt, to soothe the pain just a bit. I don't actually know what to think of Cree so far. The average drop really isn't that amazing, it kind of lets it down. Zami has the wines, Bandos has the rune items. This thing just drops a shitload of feathers <laughs> and I just can't seem to get the armor pieces which is quite upsetting. Anyway, in my third hour, another awful trip. The only drop I got was an effigy. Yay! Eventually I did get my second drop five hours in, so painful. But it was one of the better ones once again, the Armadil chest plate. I am thankful for that, or I'd have been pretty good. Five and a half hours, two drops. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Right now, here we go, heading to Vindicta next. It just had to be done following last episode's look. Just 215 kills last episode, and just in case you don't remember or happen to miss it, this is what happened. <laughs> now I really wanted to make a go of this boss and try my best to get another drop and carry on that insane look But the person I duo with went down south for two weeks with work We only managed two hours which was quite upsetting <gasps> No way, can you hear that? It can't be! <gasps> oh my fucking god, Mom! Mom, we, we got another one! We got another one! That's right guys, in just two freaking hours we managed to land yet another lance. I cannot believe my look at this boss, it just seems to get better and better. 
It was our second and final trip when we got this. Another lance, I just honestly cannot believe it. The first trip with no real drops was awesome as well. I think our best yet, 6.8 mil made in the hour. This boss really is probably one of the best money making methods for mid level PVM in the game. And then in the trip where we landed the lance, 27.9 mil made. Holy shit! Once again, progress is being made. Not in terms of the series goal itself, but the tab is really starting to be worth some cash now. The third and final boss I chose to kill in this episode was the KBD and oh my god, holy shit, this boss is fucking boring, I know. Trust me when I say that, but we've got to do it at some point. My bossing partner was away like I say, so why not start now? There's no need to involve him in this misery. I'm praying I can get this pet as soon as possible. I really am. If I even have to kill it 500 times, I'm going to be pretty upset. If it goes to the extent these boss pets can go, I'm going to cry. Hopefully, just hopefully, we can get lucky. As expected, no drops from the KBD. I will just throw this clip in as a bonus for my wasted time and yours for watching. I finally hit 1 mil XP guys, all thanks to the KBD. Yeah. No, 1 mil XP though, that's quite a nice milestone to finish with. And let's just take a quick look over the before and after stats of each boss. Armadil, not looking too good, off to a pretty slow start, but at least it was two of the better items. Vindicta in just 406 kills, even less, take away the boss mass kills, so more like just over 300. And we've had two lancers and a crest, insane look. Still no pet, but I am definitely not complaining. The KBD? Nope. <laughs> Here is a quick look at the tab though at the end of episode 2. Leave your guesses down below at how much it might be worth. I'm interested to see if you guys can get close. But yeah, that is all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.